Mr. Chung E. Yang, warmest welcome to Indonesia. We really appreciate your visit. And here are some words and messages and ideas from Indonesians for you. What South Korea means to me is a fellow middle power country that could work together with Indonesia in the global stage. And my hope for South Korea is to work together with Indonesia and to support each other to maintain peace and stability in the Asia Pacific region by supporting each other in international fora. The advancement of technology, education, and economic sectors and its active cultural diplomacy through the Korean way makes South Korea an important partner for Indonesia to strive for sustainable cooperation. I hope that South Korea and Indonesia could strengthen the mutual cooperation, particularly on infrastructure and human resource development in our strategic area. Now, on a personal level, working in a company with around 50 Korean expats, I see how we share different cultures, but at the same time, that difference is what makes us so collaborative and work well together. And I think on a national level, I'd like to see that between the country of Indonesia and also the country of Korea. We also hope to see a stronger action for peace in the Korean Peninsula. 우리는 한국에 가장 진한 친구입니다. 만나서 반갑습니다. 환영합니다. And throughout Indonesia, there are so many Korean products here, such as Loti Mart, KB Hana Bank, Samsung, among other things. I wish, uh, I wish to see further investment made by Korean companies to Indonesia because it's a win-win for both Indonesia and Korea. Republic of Korea is an important and strategic partner to Indonesia and ASEAN and it will continue to be. When we forge stronger partnerships, we can address myriad of global challenges, including climate change and both traditional and non-traditional security issues. And I believe that the two countries can contribute to a better, prosperous world, especially for the citizens of the two countries. As a student majoring international relations, I see South Korea as one of leading countries in Asia and even now, global community. Was I think Korea is one of Indonesia's closest friends because they are both uh, middle power countries and they can work together both politically and economically. I think they will work together uh, in recovering together from COVID-19 as they already did in the past. Korea is a reliable partner for Indonesia and for ASEAN to ensure that this region will remain uh, peaceful and prosperous for everyone. Hope that the relationship between Indonesia and Korea continue to grow and uh, benefit uh, all of us. I hope the relationship between Indonesia and Korea will getting stronger and deeper. With the robust partnership, I hope Indonesia and Korea will explore the opportunities of collaboration in investment, economic, and also cultural and development sectors to enhance the prosperity of the nations. And we do really hope the convenience of doing business and visiting each other must continue to be given to the people of both countries. South Korea's public diplomacy through music, film, culture, food honestly made me really happy to be a student of international relations. Korean culture make my studies and research more enjoyable while in college. Actually, the entertainment that I usually enjoy turns out to be a material of discussion as well as learning. I hope Indonesia can also learn about popularizing culture like South Korea. I also believe that the relationship between the two countries will always build strong, especially the positive image among their society. Korea has been increasing its quality in technology rapidly from the past few years and its economy has been growing really fast. Indonesia needs to learn from Korea in many aspects. 
I hope Korea will become one of the strongest countries in Asia and will bring many positive impacts for Asia. Welcome to Indonesia! There you have it, Foreign Minister Chung Yi Young. Messages from your friends in Indonesia. I hope you have a pleasant stay and very productive visit. See you again soon.